What's going on, everybody? It's your favorite dating coach, Elliot Scott. And as you can see by the title below, we are going to talk about uh, a guy's actions and words not lining up. Now, if you haven't yet, please subscribe. Just click the red button below. And if you want to work with me uh, in terms of a phone or email session, links are down in the description along with my course, Attraction Academy. Ladies, please invest in your dating life. Even if you don't have a particular situation or um, or running into a problem or even a guy, okay, uh, even if you're not talking to anyone, it is important to understand the concepts, the fundamentals, the foundation, and to at least talk to me on the phone, okay, for 30 minutes to tighten your game up and understand these theories and philosophies will save yourself so much time, energy, effort, and all this bullshit that's going on in the dating world. Women just do not invest in their dating lives. They don't think they have to, but it's no different than anything else, okay? But jumping into this... I have a client here, or not a client, a comment from one of my YouTube channels or my YouTube videos. I only have one channel. And I commented on this already, but I want to give her a little more insights um, and depth on what's going on here. So I decided to make this video because I know a lot of you are running into the same problems. So it says, so one of my guy friends is saying that he doesn't like me. Um, and only sees me as a friend, has no feelings, which is fine. I can't change that, but I'm confused. I don't understand why he'd invite me out to moving and dinner multiple times. What guy does that, unless they're interested? Calls me cute, sex me, uh, that he says he'll never let me down. Help, I help calm him, saying he loves talking to me all the time, inviting me to all these games. I mean, I doubt he's a player. He doesn't seem that way at all. Me and him never hanged out, hung out before. But it always seems like he wanted to. I don't know if he's scared or just doesn't want a relationship. He told me that he has trouble opening up in the past and that he hasn't been in a relationship for two years. I know we can't change his answer. I'm just lost on what the hell uh, the deal is. He seems a little bit emotionally immature too. Okay, ladies. So first, let me just say this. I, look, and I, 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 I'm beating a dead horse because I say in all my videos. I don't care if a guy is cuddling you and he is holding you and you two just had the best time of your life the best dates i don't care if you had the best sex and he's holding there and he's looking in your eyes and saying all these sweet things if a guy ever 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 tells you okay now don't literally mean i don't really mean ever holy shit there's gonna be people in there who says actually i know somebody of a friend of a friend okay whatever but 99 percent of the time if a guy says, I have no feelings for you, and I see you as a friend, trust me, all the shit that happens after that is irrelevant. He does not like you. He does not see you as a girlfriend. He has no feelings for you. Now, women will say, well, why does he do all these other things then? Well, first off, I would say that the one about taking you to a movie and dinner multiple times, um, I do that with my friends. My friends and I go out all the time and shit like that, okay? Um, so that that's irrelevant. But the call me cute, sex me, and all this other stuff. Okay, all, here's the thing. Well, you can still have access to the assets and not like somebody. Like, I don't have to like you to sex you. You know, and all these other th things, I would say, I guarantee if I did my detective work, because you said he's emotionally immature and he hasn't had a relationship in two years and he has trouble opening up and he's scared and, and, and all this shit from his past, I guarantee you're, he, you're, he's using you to, not using, I think you're friends, but you're filling a void for him. You're giving him attention. You're giving him validation that he cannot get in a relationship because he can't be in one. You even said right here he's, he might be scared and he's emotionally unavailable or immature. Okay? So you, I tell women all the time, you got to do your detective work. It's very logical. It's very, very, and I'm not saying you're not logical for this, but it's... You know, because again, you, you said uh, uh, there's a little comment thread that her and someone else had. And she was justifying instead of qualifying this guy, and she knows him better, of course, than we do. So, I mean, I'm, I'm not telling her she's wrong, but just from reading this right here, you can get access to the assets. Doesn't mean he doesn't care about you as a friend. Doesn't mean he's playing you. Doesn't mean he's using you. Doesn't mean he's old, he's a big piece of shit. Um, now people would argue with that. But at the same time, he says, I don't have feelings for you. I only see you as a friend. So he could, so he could do all these other things with the context or the prefix of, okay, well, she knows I don't like her. She knows I'm 
uh, I'm not looking for anything. She knows we're just friends. So I can gain these assets or access to these assets. And and, and, I, and I, I'm justified. In do, I'm, I'm not leading her on. I don't feel like I'm leading her on. I don't feel like she thinks anything uh, anything else of it because I told her. Now, of course, you don't. You know, you're you're talking, and I'm reading this, and it says, or you t- you say that you're confused and stuff. But I'm telling you right now, it's because you're probably filling a void in some way for the guy. He may, whether he's doing it consciously or subconsciously. Okay, that he can't get from a relationship because he's emotionally immature, maybe unavailable. He hasn't been in one. He's scared because of his past. Um, whatever it is. Okay, but if a guy says, I don't like you, I don't have feelings for you, trust me, I don't care whatever he says after that. It That is that. He does not have feelings for you. It just trust me, ladies, don't justify it. Don't beat around the bush. You're not Dr. Phil. He just doesn't have any feelings, okay? I would say here it's more psychological. All these other things are just assets to or access to the assets. I said ten times now, sorry. Um, uh, because if you do your detective work, I guarantee you can find he's trying to fill a void, whether it's validation, attention from a woman, he likes it, it's fun, through it, whatever, but he is hoping that he is not painting the picture in your head that it could be something more, which is why he says what he says. And he feels justified in doing so um, because he feels like he's not leading you on because obviously he told you, okay? He, He created the context. So with that being said, ladies, I love you. Take care and peace.